Welcome, foolish mortals, to the Haunted Mansion. There are several prominent ghosts who have retired here from creepy old crypts all around the world. Actually, we have 99 happy haunts here, but there's room for a thousand. Any volunteers? Perhaps you lack the proper motivation. Check out some of our other satisfied customers. For example, this fair maiden. A beautiful brunette holding a parasol. But as the portrait comes into full view, we discover that the girl is in fact walking a tightrope. Below her is an anxious alligator anticipating its next meal. The tightrope girl is one of the mansion's most popular residents, beloved by both park guests and ghosts alike. This has led to much speculation about her identity. So if you're not too afraid, let's delve further into the mansion and see what we can find. In the Haunted Mansion comic by Slave Labor Graphics, we learned about Daisy De La Cruz. Daisy was a member of a circus troupe who found themselves stuck in the Louisiana Bayou. Daisy set up a permanent camp there and continued her tightrope act. Because of her beauty and poise, she became extremely popular with the men of the area. Through magic or perhaps voodoo, Daisy would transform her gentleman callers into alligators she would keep as pets. Anxious to get their revenge, the gators floated beneath the tightrope, waiting for the maiden to slip. Lillian O'Malley is a name that first popped up in the Ghost Gallery, a history of the mansion's guests written by Disney Park cast members. Lillian fell in love with Master Gracie. When the two were wed, Madame Leota became extremely jealous. Lillian Gracie wanted to continue her passion as a tightrope walker even after moving to the mansion. They erected a rope extending from the mansion to Tom Sawyer Island. While Lillian was crossing the rope, a large gator appeared in the water below. Seems Leota used her power to summon the beast. One misstep later, and Lillian Gracie met her unfortunate end. One of the best clues to the girl's identity can be found in a poem guests can discover outside the mansion. In the swamp, poor Sally Slater was eaten by an alligator. The poem was written by Prudence Pock, a ghostwriter at the Haunted Mansion. The identity seems the most plausible since it actually appears in... rather outside the mansion. And there they are. Three possible aliases for the tightrope girl. Which one do you think is most plausible? Tell us your thoughts in the comment section below. And don't forget to check out some of these other videos showcasing some of our other guests from The Haunted Mansion. <laughs>